In today's video, we're diving into the must-have new mods for Skyrim this November. From innovative gameplay tweaks to visually stunning enhancements, these mods bring a fresh experience to your adventures in Tamriel. Let's get started and check out some mods you definitely won't want to miss this month. First, let's take a look at the combat-related section. The first mod that caught my eye is the Sky Tactics Dynamic Combat Styles mod. This mod brings over 80 unique dynamic combat styles to NPCs, making each encounter unpredictable and challenging. Using Skypatcher, combat styles are distributed randomly based on each NPC's role, adding an extra layer of depth to gameplay. With more than 80 new combat styles assigned to NPCs according to their roles, each battle feels distinct, making combat more engaging and varied. This mod takes Skyrim's combat experience to new heights, creating a richer, more immersive adventure. Next up is NPC Spell Variants, Spell Variety AI. This mod enhances NPC's spellcasting variety by distributing a wide range of spells from Enicion's Apocalypse Spell Pack, using Spell Perk Item Distributor and Keyword Item Distributor. Previously, Spellcasting NPCs often used a single, predictable spell. But with this mod, NPCs wield a diverse range of spells, making their attacks less predictable and battles more engaging. It's a great upgrade for those wanting a more dynamic and challenging experience when facing spellcasters in Skyrim. Give your magic-wielding foes a powerful upgrade. Next up is Dragon Tongue Shout Framework. This mod redefines the shout system, shifting focus from cooldowns to character builds, stats, and playstyle. Instead of relying solely on cooldowns, shouts now consume stamina, magicka, or health, depending on your character's stats. If a specific stat is low, a cooldown is applied, but you can edit shout stat consumption in the dragonborn.ini file. It also provides additional settings for compatibility with mods like Thunderchild. This framework lets you develop shout styles suited to each character type, whether a magicka-focused mage or a health-heavy warrior, making shouts more dynamic and strategic. Next up is engaging combat, keep combat dynamic at higher levels. This lightweight, highly compatible mod is designed to keep combat exciting even at higher levels. When the player fails to block or dodge an NPC's attack, their armor rating gradually decreases by a certain percentage making them more vulnerable. This effect can stack up to a maximum of 95%, resulting in potentially deadly damage. Unlike the consistent damage in vanilla, this mod's progressive damage idea adds a fresh twist to combat. The unexpected accumulating damage keeps the player on their toes, adding tension and making each encounter feel more unpredictable and challenging. Next up is Stance NG Key Util Support. This mod enhances the original Stance's NG by integrating key trace support, expanding the folder structure to make the Stance's mod even more versatile. While the original Stance's NG had a single folder, this mod introduces five folders corresponding to different movement keys, forward, backward, left, right, and neutral. By simply placing movesets into these designated folders, players can easily customize their own unique stances based on movement direction, creating a smoother and more personalized combat experience. In this section, I'll be introducing some moveset-related mods, and I'm excited to start with the BDO Sura Blade moveset. Inspired by the Sura Blade from Black Desert Online, this mod introduces a fresh set of dynamic moves for your character. To use this moveset, Craft the Sura Blade and Sura Blade Scabbard at the Forge, and equip them to unleash swift, katana-style attacks. The core animations focus on rapid, flowing strikes, but when you execute a diagonal power attack, you temporarily switch to dual wielding and unleash an incredibly fast-paced assault. The moveset also includes a unique teleport ability, where you stab the blade into the ground and instantly shift position, along with a sleek sheathing animation that adds cinematic flair. Pressing both left and right buttons simultaneously triggers a buff, generating a dark red aura on your blade. The dodge move, which uses teleportation, adds a stylish edge that will appeal to fans of fast, 
agile katana style combat. For anyone who enjoys high speed precision attacks, this moveset is a must have addition. Next up is the Asian the Sword Saint moveset collection. Inspired by the legendary swordsman Ashina Ishin, this moveset captures the refined elegance and power of traditional swordsmanship. It features both combat and non combat animations combining the use of sword and spear for a unique fighting style. To activate the moveset, equip the Mortal Blade and Ashina Spear. Although the attack speed is on the slower side, each strike has extended reach, delivering a heavy, powerful feel that showcases the weapon's strength. Certain attack animations include launching devastating slashes while leaping through the air, adding to the fierce impression. The combination of katana and spear is distinctive and feels impactful in every motion. With custom sounds and effects, each swing resounds with a majestic intensity, making this powerful moveset a must-have addition to your collection. In this section, we're diving into visual enhancement mods. First up is Cathedral 3D Rocks. This mod introduces highly detailed 3D rocks, stones, and pebbles to areas originally intended by Bethesda to feature rugged terrain. Inspired by Highland environments, it enriches Skyrim's landscapes while staying true to the game's original artistic vision. By adding realistic rock formations and textures, the mod brings a new level of immersion to the terrain. Next up is Bedroll Alternative. This mod provides a revamped bedroll, replacing the default with a new mid-poly model and 2K textures. It even includes optional BOS color variations and a patch for use those blankets. Designed with a white pillow tied in leather straps and a brown patterned blanket, this bedroll captures the look we've all imagined, a practical, immersive alternative to the original rough fur roll. Next up is On The Mend, a healing altar replacer. This mod transforms the healing altar at the Temple of Kinnereth in Whiterun, replacing the old, uncomfortable setup with a high-poly model in 2K textures with a low-poly option available as well. The redesigned altar features clean bedding and a soft pillow filled with healing herbs, creating a more inviting and comforting space for recovery. This upgrade enhances the immersive experience by making the altar look not only sacred, but also cozy and restorative, as if genuinely prepared for healing. Next up is Redoran Reverie, a Dunmer furniture replacer. This mod upgrades the furniture in the Solstheim region to better reflect the refined taste of Dunmer nobility. Featuring mid to high poly models with 2K textures, it adds beautifully detailed new furniture to Morvane Manor, Severin Manor, and the Temple, giving these interiors a more sophisticated feel. Additionally, when paired with Dunmer Dreams, a dark elf bed replacer, this mod enhances Dunmer beds across Solstheim as well. This bed replacer adds high-quality wood textures and intricate designs with BOS support to offer various color options. The centerpiece of each bed, a white pillow adorned with House Redoran's crest, adds a rich layer of immersion. Together, these mods allow you to transform Dunmer furniture and bedding in Skyrim, making it feel even more realistic and luxurious. Upgrade the ambiance of Dunmer interiors and bring new depth to the cultural details of Solstheim. To wrap up this video, let's take a look at the Tomb Raider Lara Croft Classic Cosplay Outfit. This mod brings the iconic style of Lara Croft to Skyrim, featuring a classic cosplay outfit inspired by the legendary Tomb Raider character. It's compatible with CBBE, 3BA, Body Slide and Outfit Studio, and includes HDT, SMP physics for added realism. While the casual look and pistol accessory might feel a bit out of place in Skyrim's world, the outfit itself is beautifully designed and could be a great addition to your mod list. It's a fun choice for anyone looking to add a unique twist to their character's look. That wraps up our November picks for Skyrim mods you shouldn't miss. Hopefully you found some new favorites to add to your load order. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave a comment on which mods you're most excited to try out. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.